Hey everybody, this is Kevin Potter, and I'm going to show you how to put our 12 inch shear together. So, if you buy one of these, it's going to come in a box packed with foam, and with any luck, it won't get wrecked by the post office. This part here weighs about 45 pounds, and it comes in two boxes. One box has this, the main body of the shear. Your other box has this, has the table the blade guard, and the handle. So in this video I'm going to show you how to put it together. So what you do, first thing I would put the handle on. It comes with all the hardware and the handle fits in here. Three bolts. It goes together real easy. Washers, and nuts. So the next step that you're going to do is you're going to put this table on. There's two countersunk Allen head bolts. They're going to go in here. Well, they're going to go in here. Goes like that. And it sets on there. And it fits right up against the blade here. You'll see that it fits perfectly. Put the washers and the nuts on. I'm just finger tightening these for the video, but you're going to want to use a wrench. There we go. Then the blade guard. You have to use the blade guard. This not only protects your fingers, but it holds the metal down when you're cutting. That way it doesn't bend over. And there's two knobs. Put this screw down. I know a lot of you will remove the blade guard, but don't. So then, you're ready to cut. So we'll put lift the blade guard up a little bit. Slide the piece in. I'm going to take a real light cut just to see. Here's the cut. This is a piece of 16 gauge copper. And it left a perfect edge, no burr. The next video I'm going to show you guys how to change out your blades because someday you're going to wear the blades out or someone is going to damage the blades and you're going to need to replace them. So in the next video I'm going to show how to do that. Thanks for watching.